Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am giving you guys an exciting update for my Throwback 30 project pan. Um, this project um, is in collab with the Fantastic Ladies. Um, I will try to link their Facebook group down below in my description, but I have not been um, the best at putting my descriptions in. Um, but this project started July 28th um, this year and it goes um, for a whole year until next July 28th of 2022. So this project, um, we picked 30 different things that, um, 30 things that correlated with 30 different projects. So we picked one thing up from each project. Um, so I am just going, I'm not going over all 30 things. I am just going to go over the things that I have actually used in the past month. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. The first thing for 50 Shades of Panning, um, I use this Naked Cosmetics um, um, Single Shadow. It's actually a loose shadow in Naturally Nude. So um, it is actually what I have on my eyes today. Um, it kind of looks like this, like that. Um, I currently now have three uses on this. Um, everything that I want to use in this project, I want to use 30 times because it is throwback 30. So within a year, I want to use them each up 30 times um, or use completely up. So I have three, three, um, three uses on that. Um, all right. The next thing is from Seven Deadly Pans, and this is Envy. Um, it's my Pure Lease Matcha Green Tea um, Priming Moisturizer. I use this almost every single morning that I do my makeup. Um, I currently have twenty nine uses on this. So tomorrow, when I do my makeup, this is going to be done. But I'm probably going to keep using it. Um, so that's the 30 uses on that will be done tomorrow. So you guys will not see an update on this next month. Um, but it has a big air bubble. So I don't really know where I'm at in this pro with this product. Um, but I have used it 29 times. So, so exciting um, to get that used up and out of my collection or out of my project. Um, the very next thing is going to be from Beauty A to Z, um, is my Soap and Glory One Heck of a Blot Foundation. Um, I have two more uses on this guy. This is not my favorite foundation. The pump stopped working, so I am just using this whenever I feel like it. Uh, so I currently have 12 uses on this, um, so we are almost halfway um, halfway used up. So, um, I am still working on that. All right. The very next thing is something from the drop 10 before summer project pan. And this was my Tahiti, uh, pink Lily and Bamboo, bamboo fragrance mist. Uh, I finally used this 30 times. I used my 30th time today. Um, and let's see if I can get a rough estimate. Um, we are currently right here where my thumb's at. So we are almost, I'm almost completely used this, uh, spray up in this project. I am going to keep using this until I completely use it up. I probably will actually take this to work and put it in um, my purse, but, um, next month you guys won't see this in the project because I used it my 30 times and I'm so excited. I'm finally getting, um, to the point where I'm almost using some of my products. Um, all right. The next thing we have is something from the fall for you project pan. Um, and this is my benefit roller lash. This is one of my all time favorite mascaras. Um, I used this four more times, um, this past month, uh, bringing me up to eight uses. So I have eight uses on this. Um, I was trying to use up another mascara last month, so that's why this doesn't have as many uses. Um, so I know I'm going to get a ton of uses on this, this month. 
All right. So the next thing is from the movie Madness. Um, and I chose this Too Faced Hangover 3-in-1 Setting Spray. Um, it is getting very light, so um, that's a good sign. I used this, let's see, 11 more times, um, bringing my total up to 28. 28 uses, so two more uses, and this is gone. Um, this is out of this project, but... I'm probably going to still keep using this until it is used up because it is getting very, very low. This used to be my one of my favorite um, setting sprays until I found the Morphe um, Continuous Setting Mist. That is now my favorite uh, setting spray. So I do really like this too. Um, I just like the sprayer on that um, Morphe Setting Mist one better. But two more uses on that and that is out of the project. Um, next we have something from the Nightmare Before Christmas project pan. Um, and I chose my ColourPop Gather Round Sisters palette. Um, and I currently have 14 uses on here. So I used this nine more times in the project. So I did use this a lot last month. Um, let's see. I know I used it's purple. I use that purple. I know I used this, this one. Um, I used Hello Salem a lot for a, just like a crease shade. I used this Wint shade, um, a couple times. So I have been using this palette like crazy and I, um, definitely really enjoyed it last month when I was playing with it. All right, the next thing is from Painting Solitaire. Um, this is my single shadow that I'm working with. Um, it's the ColourPop Hi-Ho from the um, Disney Designer Collection. So if you can tell, I use this almost every day as like my lid um, shade. Um, I am getting very close to hitting pan on this. I use my finger to apply this because it is kind of like a wetter formula and it applies better with my finger. Um, let's see how many times I've used this. I've used this 30 times. So at this point, I would say that I would hit um, my goal on this. But for this project, you are supposed to start with a single shadow go with a duo, trio, and quad. So I might do it to where that once I hit pan on one of the one of these, then I'm going to um, go to the next one. So I'll have to hit a pan on a duo and then and then keep going. So so far I'm still keeping this in the project for now. All right, the next thing is from the Significant Other Project Pan. Um, my daughter actually picked this product out um, and it's the ColourPop, ColourPop, ColourPop Blush You Are Magnifico from the Lizzie McGuire Collection. Um, it's a very, very bright, bright blush um, and it has shimmer in it. So it's like a blush and highlight together. And I have a total of five uses on this. So I need to get going on this, um, this product. All right. The next thing is from the Skin Is In Project Pan. And I chose my um, first, aid booty, first Aid Beauty Gentle Foaming Face Cleanser. Um, this thing is getting very, very light. It's getting very, very gross because it's been in my shower. Um, I currently have 20 uses on this. So I have 10 more uses and this is going to be out of the uh, project. Um, I'm going to say 10 uses might do it and this might be done, but who knows? I don't know. We'll see. All right. And the very last thing that I'm going to talk about in this project is from the Four Seasons Project Pan. Um, and I chose the Body Shop British Rose Body Yogurt. Um, I finally used this four times. Um, I have four times written down. I might have used it a little more than that. Oh my goodness, this smells so good. So um, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to get 30 uses out of this. I think by my 30 use mark, I'm going to have this completely done. But yeah, it's a very, very light um, 
lotion. So this might not get any more use until um, spring, summertime again, because it is starting to, to get colder out, um, starting to get dry. My legs are starting to itch more. So I need more of like a moisturizing um, lotion than kind of like what this offers. This doesn't offer much um, moisturization. So there's that. Um, and then the rest of the pro products I either have not used at all or haven't used um, since the last update. So that is going to do it for this um, project pan. Um, if you guys like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye guys.